So we worked out from here that if you add hot water to a sugar lump, it dissolves much more quickly than if you add cold water to a sugar lump. Okay, so now we're going to do the experiment exactly the same, but we're going to keep the temperature the same. So I've got two measuring cylinders that they've got, both got hot water in them. But instead, what I've changed is the surface area, okay? So in this one, we've got the sugar lump. The sugar lump has got a very small surface area because the cube has only got certain amount of area available for the hot water to work its soluble magic on. However, in the granulated sugar, we've crushed it up. So the surface area is now massive compared to the um, hot water. So... Think back, what do you think is going to dissolve more quickly? Hot water sugar lump or hot water granulated? We're going to do exactly the same kind of experiment. Remember, we've got the same temperature of water. Hope you're doing this at home. And I've got my diagrams here. I'm going to try again. And this time I'm going to make sure that my stirring action is the same because I'm right-handed. It's quite difficult to make my stirring action the same, but that makes it a fair test, keeping everything the same. Are you ready? <laughs> Oh, look. Right, well, look. Stop. Can you see? My granulated sugar has already dissolved and my sugar lump is still in there. So what does that tell you? Well, that tells you that if you increase the surface area, things dissolve a lot more quickly. So here, it's all dissolved way more quickly because we've got a higher surface area compared to here. We kept the temperature the same, but all we changed was the surface area. So I'm now gonna put that on my board with my board pen. So this hot water, that took longer. And this one only took 22 seconds. This one would have taken about the same because it's exactly the same experiment, remember? So I'm actually going to scrub that out and I'm going to write 31 seconds like last time. And you can see that if you add, if you increase the surface area, it dissolves much more quickly. Well done, Year 8. Hope you've had a nice time doing that at home. If you haven't, maybe you can have a go later.